Hello, my name is Remo Krause. I'm head of product management at Ravenol. My name is Alexander Nitit. I work in product development at Ravenol. Today, we'll both be explaining a bit about the revolutionary USVO technology from Ravenol. Alexander, USVO stands for Ultra Strong Viscosity Oil. But what's so special about it? Well, USVO technology is really all about making sure that the lubricants are as stable as possible over their entire service life in the engine. So it's primarily a case of making sure that the lubricant viscosity ideally doesn't change at all in the particular usage conditions. And Ravenol now has the tried and tested Clean Sinto technology. So why has the USVO technology been developed? The Clean Sinto technology is designed in particular to ensure a clean engine and very good wear protection. With USVO, the aim is a little bit different. It's more about ensuring that the lubricants are as long-lasting as possible, in addition to their outstanding cleaning properties. We've made it our task to overcome the challenges faced by lubricants of the future. And it was this task that led Ravenol to develop the USVO technology. You mentioned viscosity loss. Is that why USVO technology was developed? Exactly. The viscosity loss was the main reason we developed the USVO technology. It was first and foremost about keeping the viscosity loss as low as possible over the service life of the lubricant, or ideally preventing it from happening at all. That's why we try not to use any VI improvers wherever possible, because these VI improvers can break down and cause a loss of viscosity. Wherever possible, we try to work with high-viscosity, fully synthetic base oils. And these, of course, provide additional benefits. You've talked about the use of high-quality base oils. What makes this base oil so special? Exactly. The high-quality base oils are specifically those oils in the API Group 4 and 5, i.e. polyalpha olefins, PAO, and esters. These are characterized by their particularly high oxidation stability, their excellent friction values, and their low evaporation loss. Can you give us a bit more detail about these polymer-based index improvers? I'll be happy to. So polymer-based VI improvers are used in all modern engine oils. We distinguish between several different types. I've got a few examples here. The most widespread and most commonly used VI improver is the OCP polymer. It doesn't look like much here, but these solid substances that we have in this bag can also be found in engine oil. These polymers make sure that the oil reflects the intended properties as closely as possible both in cold and warm conditions. This means that the molecules in this polymer expand in the heat and contract in the cold. And there are different types of molecules. OCP, for example, is a very, very simple molecule. More complicated VI improvers, such as styrene dean star polymers, have a much more complex structure and also have a different effect, but are much more stable as well. So wherever we weren't able to use high-viscosity PAOs, because the viscosity grade doesn't allow it, or because other technical characteristics don't allow it, we only use very stable and very high-quality star polymers. So if we take all of these aspects together, what's the benefit of this PAO-based lubricant? PAO-based lubricants are primarily characterized by their improved friction values. This leads to fuel savings, sometimes fuel savings of up to 1%, simply due to switching from a synthetic to a fully synthetic oil. We also have a lower evaporation loss. This is described in daily laboratory practice using the NOAC value. You can see the NOAC value as an indicator for how much oil evaporates during operation. The worse the NOAC value, the more oil evaporates, and so the more oil needs to be topped up during operation. Our USVO technology has a very, very low NOAC value, i.e., a very low evaporation loss. There's no need for any topping up. Which saves money for our customers. And the PAOs are also characterized by their excellent oxidation stability. This means that the oil ages less quickly than normal, and they also provide an improved cleaning effect. And the low temperature properties are also worth highlighting again, because PAO-based lubricants can pump through the engine extremely well, even in cold conditions. This means that even with a cold start, the oil to gets where it needs to be more quickly, is pumped there more quickly, and gets to where it's needed even at minus 30 degrees, which also saves a huge amount of fuel. You've talked about star-shaped viscosity index improvers. What's the difference between these and conventional VIs? 
The main difference is that they're more stable. We've carried out a series of tests about this and tested conventional VIs against our USVO VIs, as well as against our completely polymer-free USVO products. It's really clear to see from these tests, even when the test cycles are extended far beyond the normal scope. So if we look at an example, Mercedes-Benz demands 90 cycles on a shear stability tester. We extended the test interval to 250 cycles, and even here, our USVO products always do extremely well and lose barely any viscosity. So it's these star-shaped VIs in particular. If they lose viscosity, it happens very, very late, and it's not by as much as with conventional VIs. You can easily see from this graphic, our USVO product, RCS5W40, the blue line, is an example of USVO technology that's completely free from VI improvers. It gives almost no viscosity loss, even over 250 cycles. Our VST 5W40 with a star-shaped VI improver always does much better than the standard 5W40, which is HC-based and is produced with standard OCP. And finally, you can also say that USVO technology is characterized in particular by its excellent high temperature viscosities, its outstanding low temperature viscosities, and its very high oxidation stability combined with a very low evaporation loss and a high and stable VI. Thank you for watching. If you have any other questions, please feel free to contact the Ravenol team. You can find the contact details in the info box. Ravenol, the lifeblood of your car.